Hello, everybody. <clears throat> um, this week's topic, or last week's topic, is about back to school and transitioning. Um, I had to remake this video because I shot it at work, and I felt rushed, you know what I mean? Um, I was borrowing work's computer, and I didn't want somebody to come in um, and buy something, and me having to like stop what I'm doing or saying tend to a customer and then it just it was just rushed you know so I thought I would remake it um, okay so transitioning for me um, I transition late in my life um, I'm in my 30s and when I was younger um, I was feminine uh, sometimes extreme feminine and uh, came out as a lesbian and so I didn't I didn't really like um, had to really transition while going to school so I don't know what that process would have been like for myself um, but transitioning in a work environment is extremely difficult I feel like I'm constantly um, telling the world about trans and me and I don't I mean I, what I say about that is I just I don't pass completely and I'm at the stage where for, in my transition where I I'm confusing to everybody people don't know what to say to me buddy um, <clears throat> some sometimes people overly like ma'am me um sometimes just random people right and i'm not gonna obviously go around correcting everybody but because i mean my profession is acting um so i'm i take very different jobs and odd jobs and i'm very very open or i decided to be very very open um just when i entered 2014 I decided to live my life very openly in terms of um, if people ask I'll tell them um, but I'm not going to be like hi my name is and I'm trans you know um, so what I do I go to my bosses so I could I guess I'm talking about you know starting a new job as opposed to going back to school um, if that's okay um, but Starting a new job is difficult, um, for sure. Um, for me, being confusing to people, I don't pass, like I said. Um, you can see people's wheels turning when they address me um, or talk to me. You know, some people are just like, yeah, dude, like, blah, blah, blah. Some people are like, just using my name, which is fine, you know. Um, but i been going to my bosses and I've been pretty open even in interviews I've been like okay but I want to work in an environment where this type of thing would be accepted um, and at least if my co-workers try then I know customers and other uh, people that come into the business um, are going to try and you know um, and not question it um, so I work at this awesome cafe where we deal with uh, Vega One uh, protein shakes. It's very motivating for my workouts. I've been working out because of that. Um, and during my interview, that was something I was like, I love the concept of your cafe. You know, you promote healthy living. Um, and one of the things is I also want to be in an environment where it's healthy for me. So. Um, this is how I identify, and hopefully that's okay. And they're like, great, fine, that's went wonderful. Um, you know, you don't discriminate here, and it's owned by two gay men, um, husbands, <laughs> and they're amazing. And the rest of the staff is great. I wear, I'm like the only guy uh, staff member, and then I work with other like girls, women, um, and it's fantastic. No complaints. Um, making this video too long and um, yeah so coming out I just go to my HR or go to my bosses 
explain my situation um, if I don't if I passed completely I don't think it's something that will matter um, although it might because I'm not change I've decided not to change uh, my name if my middle name my girl middle name um, keeping it keeping my documents as they are um, I'm not sure if I even want to change my gender marker uh, that's something that I'm, I'm not sure about like document wise um, I think the more I pass maybe that's something that I will change in terms of gender marker but definitely not changing my names um, so that might be an issue like going into you know uh, a new job and then seeing one thing and looking at me and this is what happened at this other job that I got um, that I'm actually quitting today um, but they're so amazing they I gave them I was so scared to give them all my IDs so I gave them all my IDs and I took these IDs like five years ago or four years ago or not and uh, saying um, all my documents and they say you know female and they say uh, my for the first few years when I lived here, my names were switched, so my feminine name was in the front, and then my gender neutral name that my parents gave me was in the middle. Um, and so they look at me, and they, and they just still was like, yeah, man, buddy, come on, buddy, like, you can, you know, they treat me like normal. Um, yeah, so that's the only thing I would say is like, make sure, oh my god, this is so long, make sure um, you talk to HR, make sure you let your colleagues know, and, um, yeah, that's it, right? Um, be as open as you feel comfortable. If you don't feel comfortable, then don't. Uh, don't even go there. Just deal with it the way you need to deal with it. Um, yeah, but that's how I'm dealing with things is that I'm trying to be a lot more open, um, in terms of my bosses and stuff like that. Peace out, everybody. I will see you soon.